Hey, what's up, guys? What's up? This is officially the first Friday in 2022 that Medellin has no more masks to wear in public spaces unless you are in a concert or some kind of public event where there are many, many people crowded together. You still have to wear them on the metro, on public transport, metro, you know, buses and everything, but walking out here in the street, here on La Setenta, this is La Setenta here in Medellin, Colombia. Uh, so this week it was decreed by the president that you no longer have to wear them in public, in public spaces like this. And so you will see a lot of people now, or some people not wearing them. Others are wearing them. So I wanted to bring you that uh, information here from the Setenta. So you never know if things are going to change tomorrow or the day after because of so many things going on. And check this out. There, this is the, the, the a second or third area where some foreigners love to come, but this is most, mostly Colombians. And this is Boulevard La Setenta. They got salsa, uh, bars, merengue bars and everything, nightclubs, where you can watch dances, everything. And you got it all here on La Setenta. You just take the metro. So check it out. But mostly what I'm telling you is the first Friday in 2022 where you don't have to wear a mask. If you're still traveling by plane, of course, by bus, cab, metro here in Colombia, you do have to wear a mask. So that's why you're noticing people walking by and a few without the mask. Some are still wearing them. And this is a Friday. So this is today that I'm sending you this video for all of you guys. And wow, what do you think? Leave your opinions down in the comment section below. And this is La Setenta. I have videos that I've done here before and a live stream or two. So you can check them out if you want to. Look for them on the channel. But just check it out. People can actually see people's smiles now. People can actually see people's faces. For the first time in almost two years in this country. Back in 2020, in March, on one long weekend, it was supposed to be for just a long weekend that they were going to do the quarantine thing and then it turned out to be almost six months until the country reopened to tourism international and domestic back on September 5th or 8th of 2022 I mean 2020 so this is Colombia one of the happiest nations in the world top five top ten happiest nations in the world guys and just see it. it it seems like a big burden or a heavy cloud dark cloud has been lifted off the shoulders of some people and I love the fact that we can be out here again and I can actually see the smiles on a woman's face on women's faces so why did they do this the government said, the, the mayor of Medellin, I saw the video, he, he said that the reason why is because more than 70% of the population in Colombia has already got the full certificate, the full scheme of the jabs. More than 70%. That's another nice place where they play vaginatos and everything, cacique. And there over there on the corner is salsa, old school salsa like... Andy Montañez, Oscar de Leon, Oscar de Leon, Ruben Blades, Mark Anthony, etc. So this is a Friday night here in beautiful Medellin, Colombia. And this area is pretty safe in case you're new to the channel. Hector Lavo. Wow. Joy Arroyo. So yeah, 
We're back in business. The boys are back in town, baby. This is San Juan Avenue. Chontoludo fruit. Chontoludo fruit. Never eaten it, but it's called Chontoludo. And this is San Juan Avenue. And these are the mountains of Bush. I mean, of Medellin, Colombia. So, catch you on the rebound. Enjoy life. Have fun. And visit Colombia. Stay tuned for more videos. This was unplanned. This video today was unplanned. But I felt I should share the information with you and show you a little bit of the Friday nightlife. It's only about 6.30 p.m. So, catch you later. Alligators. Catch you in the wild. Crocodile.